what's up guys thank you to everyone who watches my videos all of my friends and supporters of my work and please remember to subscribe to my new youtube channel that you are watching now so i get i get a lot of questions on a daily basis i will wake up every morning and see like 50 new questions in my inbox from people asking questions about magic and sorcery and how they can change their lives and one of the things that i will hear over and over it was like hey js you know your your work re looks really awesome and effective but it's a little too extreme for my life or it's a little too extreme for me but my life sucks and my life is in shambles you know so what can i do and that baffles me all right and the other thing that i will hear from these same people I'll talk to somebody, either face to face or through messenger, and they'll they will tell me about some god awful problem that they are facing in their life, and I will take my personal time to tell them exactly what they need to do to give them a ritual to create the necessary change in their life that will fix that problem, and then I'll hear from them six months to a year later. I'm like, hey, how's it going? And they'll tell me, oh, oh, this problem, you know, it got better for a little while, but then it got worse. And, you know, this, this and that, I'm still struggling. I'm still in the same spot I was last time I talked to you. And my question always is, did you do the fucking ritual? Did you actually do the ritual that I gave you to do in, your, in its entirety? And the, and the answer to that question is always no. No, I didn't. I was going to, but then I got distracted. Or I was going to, but then this happened, and then this happened, and then this happened, and this happened, and I never did the ritual, and I'm still facing the same fucking problem. Or they'll say, oh, I have bought all these books on magic spells, but none of them have improved my life. And I'll say, have you done any of the rituals in those books? And they'll always say, no, I have not. Okay. Come on now, people. There's a reason. <laughs> There's a reason why we do ritual. There is a reason why these rituals are printed in these magic books. Okay. It's because you have to do the fucking ritual in order to get the desired result. You can't just read a book. You can't just think about doing a ritual. You can't just whine about your problem to some magician that you can find to converse with you on Facebook or any other platform. You have to do the fucking ritual in order to get the result. There's a reason why we go out of our way as magicians to perform ritual in order to create a specific change in our reality. Okay. It's not because that's what we like to do. It's not for looks. It's not for, any other reason other than that is what is required in order to facilitate that change in reality. Okay. So if you're writing me saying, I have a problem and I need to fix it. And I tell you, I take the time out of my day to tell you what the solution to that problem is and you don't do it, then don't fucking write me six months later talking about you're still dealing with the same problem. Because I honestly, I don't know anybody. No one has ever written me saying, hey, JS, I have performed this ritual and that ritual and all these other rituals and I'm still dealing with the same problem. No, not a single fucking person has ever said that to me. Okay, so anybody who is actually doing the ritual work is going to see results period all right so if you if you don't have the fortitude and the discipline to actually go through the steps and actually follow the instructions and perform the ritual to create that specific change in your life then magic's not going to do anything for you it never will because you're not actually doing magic you're reading about magic you're thinking about magic you're, you're contemplating magic, but you're not actually performing magic.
ritual magic, all right? Anybody that actually does these rituals, that follows these instructions and puts forth the time and the effort to tap into these energetic currents and these esoteric sciences that are thousands, if not millions of years old, anybody that does that is going to get the desired result, all right? Period. Every single time. Every single fucking time. So all you have to do as an aspiring magician to change your life is select a problem that you are dealing with and then find the correct ritual magic solution for that problem and then perform that ritual in its entirety. And poof, the magic happens. The magic happens. The problem magically disappears every single fucking time. But if you won't do that, then you don't deserve. You don't deserve the help of magic because you don't have the fortitude to actually practice magic. All right. So for anyone who does have the fortitude and the self-discipline to practice these ritual magic spells, these magical practices, then you're going to see results every single time because I've never heard from a person who has actually done these rituals in their entirety that has not gotten the desired result. The only people I hear from are people who don't have the fortitude to actually sit down and perform a ritual magic spell or, or, or whatever it is that they're working on in order to create that change in their reality. So that is the bottom line. That is the absolute bottom fucking line. You have to do the ritual. Otherwise, nothing is going to happen. That's all I wanted to say about that. I'm J.S. Garrett. Please subscribe to my channel. I love you, motherfuckers. Hail the Infernal Empire.